Have you ever walked down a city street, glanced at a manhole cover and wondered, why that material? Why is it almost always this heavy, dark, circular piece of metal? You see them everywhere, sidewalks, roads, alleys, industrial zones. Yet most of us just pass by without a second thought. But here's the thing, every one of those manhole covers is a small engineering marvel. And the choice of material, not random at all. In fact, there's a good reason why most manhole covers are made out of cast iron, a decision rooted in history, physics, and plain old practicality. So today, we're going to dig into the world beneath your feet and answer a surprisingly complex question. Why do manhole covers use cast iron? Let's explore, right here, on History of Simple Things. Let's start with a little bit of history. The use of manholes dates back to ancient civilizations. Rome, for example, had a fairly advanced sewer system, and some form of stone slab covers were used to access and maintain these underground channels. But it wasn't until the rise of industrialized cities in the 19th century that manholes and their covers became common urban infrastructure. As cities expanded, the need for accessible underground systems for water, sewage, gas, electricity, and later telecommunications became essential. These systems needed maintenance access and thus manholes and their covers became ubiquitous. Early manhole covers were made from stone or bricks, but these materials were heavy, brittle, and prone to breaking under pressure. Enter cast iron, a game changer. Cast iron isn't just some random metal we had lying around. It's an alloy of iron, carbon, and silicon, and it's been used in construction and machinery for centuries. What makes it ideal for manhole covers is its unique blend of strength, durability, and weight. First off, cast iron is incredibly strong under compression, meaning it can handle heavy loads, like trucks driving over it, without cracking or deforming. This is a crucial requirement for anything embedded in the roadway. Second, it's very dense. A standard manhole cover can weigh anywhere from 90 to 250 pounds, which is a good thing. Why? Because that weight keeps it in place. You don't want a manhole cover shifting around every time a vehicle passes over it. The sheer mass of cast iron ensures it stays where it belongs, securely covering the opening and preventing accidents. But weight isn't just about staying put. Safety is a big factor here. A lightweight manhole cover could easily be dislodged or even stolen. In fact, theft is a real issue in some parts of the world where metal has scrap value. The heaviness of cast iron makes theft more difficult and less tempting. Plus, from a safety standpoint, cast iron is fire resistant and doesn't deform easily under heat, which is important in environments where high temperatures or electrical currents might be present like utility vaults. Its rigidity helps maintain a consistent fit with the manhole rim, reducing the risk of a cover popping out due to pressure or expansion. Then there's the manufacturing side of things. Cast iron is relatively inexpensive to produce, especially in large volumes. The casting process, where molten iron is poured into a mold, allows for easy replication and mass production. The molds can be customized with logos, patterns, or anti-slip textures without requiring complex machinery. And because cast iron has excellent fluidity when molten, it fills molds completely, capturing fine details and ensuring uniform thickness. That's why many city manhole covers feature intricate designs or even the name of the municipality. They're cast right into the mold. So not only is cast iron practical, it's cost-effective and customizable. Now you might be wondering, why not use steel or some kind of advanced composite material? 
After all, technology has advanced. Shouldn't we have something lighter, stronger, or smarter by now? Well, there are alternatives. Ductile iron, for example, is a more flexible, impact-resistant form of cast iron that's sometimes used as a modern upgrade. Steel has been used too, especially in areas where weight is a concern, like in pedestrian walkways or indoor utility rooms. Composite materials made from resins and fiberglass are gaining popularity as well. They're much lighter, corrosion-resistant, and non-conductive, making them ideal for certain applications. But for city streets, where covers need to endure heavy, repeated traffic and extreme environmental conditions, cast iron still reigns supreme. It's cheap, proven, and more than capable of handling the abuse of urban life. This might be a bit of a tangent, but while we're on the topic of design, we have to talk about the iconic round shape. It's not a requirement, but circular manhole covers are the most common, and cast iron is a perfect material to mold into a round shape. The reason for the circle? A round cover can't fall through its own opening. That's a simple yet brilliant safety feature. Plus, it's easier to roll a circular cover than drag a square one. No need to align corners or rotate anything. Just drop it in place and it works. Combine that with cast iron's properties and you've got a match made in civil engineering heaven. Cast iron is also pretty tough when it comes to corrosion. It does rust, yes, but the rusting process actually forms a layer that protects the metal underneath, a sort of self-sealing corrosion. That's why these covers can survive for decades with minimal maintenance. Cities and utility companies love that. Less maintenance means fewer disruptions and lower costs. And when a cast iron manhole cover finally reaches the end of its life, it's fully recyclable. You just melt it down and start over. Another win for sustainability. So next time you're out walking and you step over a manhole cover, give it a second look. Underneath that simple, rugged piece of metal lies a story of engineering efficiency and material science. It's not glamorous, but it works, and it's been working for well over a century. Cast iron manhole covers are proof that sometimes the old ways really are the best ways. In an age of high-tech materials and smart everything, there's something oddly satisfying about a technology so simple, so heavy, and so reliable that it's never really needed to change. That's the power of cast iron. Thank you for watching. If you have suggestions for our next video, feel free to share them in the comments below. We'll be sure to give you an acknowledgement for your contribution. Thank you for joining us on this journey through the history of simple things. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and stay tuned for more stories woven through the smallest details.